Nióbio. Sabia que atualmente o quilo de nióbio na bolsa de metais de Londres vale 228 dólares e 57 centavos ou mais. No Brasil, o nióbio vale aproximadamente 822 reais e 85 centavos por quilograma. Um grama equivale a 82 centavos de réu. Façamos uma comparação. Um real. A moeda de um real tem o peso de 7,84 gramas aproximadamente. Se calcularmos o valor do grama de nióbio com o peso da moeda de um real, teremos o seguinte valor. Grama de nióbio, 82 centavos de real. Peso da moeda, 7,84 gramas. Resultado, R$ 6,45. Quer dizer que teremos o valor de R$ 6,45 com o mesmo peso da moeda de um real. Por que não lastrear o nióbio como moeda oficial do Brasil e usar o valor deste minério como meio de cotação? Com o preço da matéria-prima num valor inferior da moeda para garantir a estabilidade e a economia do país. Podendo ser trocado até mesmo o nome como nióbio real ou somente nióbio. Estaríamos superando o valor do dólar e certamente a economia do Brasil entraria na normalidade. The demand for steel has never been greater. Steel dominates the landscape of our modern civilizations and is the primary ingredient in the construction and manufacture of nearly everything we see, feel, and use on a daily basis. Roads, railways, appliances, vehicles, and buildings. By adding a small percentage of niobium to steel, you create a significantly stronger yet lighter steel product. Niobium alloys are used in automobile, pipeline, and structural steel industries, as well as in stainless and steel-resistant superalloys that are used in jet thrusters. In the oil and gas industries, steel used for transmission pipelines offers superior performance to withstand increased pressure and to transport huge volumes over great distances. Steel used in the construction of major structures such as bridges and skyscrapers allows greater flexibility in creating leaner and larger designs that can be built at a lower cost. And in the automobile industry, niobium alloys are used to create stronger, lighter cars, ultimately improving fuel efficiency, emissions, control, and safety. While the majority of this strategic metal comes from Brazil and a smaller supply from Canada, the United States, with its significant demands for steel production, must import 100% of its niobium supply until now. Quantum Developments Corp. is exploring Elk Creek, Nebraska for one of the richest sources of niobium in the world, with the promise of a domestic supply that could last for decades. Strengthening the future of American industry and national defense. Quantum Developments Corp. The answer is close to home.